Hi, I'm Brock with Zeppelin Design Labs. Today I'd like to introduce you to the VPM1, which is our mod for the Ernie Ball Jr. volume pedal. The first thing you'll notice about this mod is that we got rid of the string and the potentiometer, so you don't have to worry about scratchy pots or broken strings anymore. Instead, we actually use a magnet and a Hall effect sensor to control a pair of optocouplers in the signal path. In the analog circuit, the 9 volt power supply is boosted to 18 volts internally, so there's plenty of clean headroom. The gain knob can give the signal an extra 14 decibels of boost, so you can easily overdrive your tube amp with just this pedal. There's a buffered tuner output jack that can also be used to drive a different effects chain that you don't want affected by the volume pedal. The VPM1 has a completely analog signal path that is digitally controlled, allowing us to incorporate some really cool features, such as five different volume tapers to choose from. Pressing the taper button allows you to scroll through all five of them. There are three reverse logarithmic curves, which are similar to the original VP Junior sweep, and a logarithmic curve, and of course, a linear sweep. Once you find the taper you like best, just hold the button down to save your preference. Now every time you power on the VPM1, it will be set to your chosen preset. And if you love hacking, you'll be pleased to know you can actually create your own custom volume tapers, simply by modifying a few numbers in our open source Arduino code. Through the calibration process, you can set the minimum and maximum volume points anywhere along the pedal sweep, so you can actually set the range of motion that's comfortable for you. There are also a couple of upgrades you can get for this mod. The stereo upgrade operates in either a traditional stereo configuration, or by flipping a switch, it can operate in a panning configuration. And the expression upgrade allows you to use the VPM1 as an expression pedal to control other effects pedals. The dip switch on the add-on board sets the pinout of the expression jack to be configured for use with a wide range of pedals. We offer three ordering options for the VPM1. If you like to build things yourself, we offer a DIY kit, which involves soldering a couple dozen hole-through components to the board. If you aren't into soldering, we also offer the parts fully assembled, in which case you can mod your VP Junior with just a couple of screwdrivers and a drop of superglue. No soldering is required. And if you hate to get your hands dirty, you can just send us your Ernie Ball VP Junior and we'll take care of everything, and we'll send it back to you fully modded and calibrated. Visit ZeppelinDesignLabs.com for more information about the VPM1.